Hey guys, it's Sue Emma, and Creative Grids are back with our brand new Perfect 5 ruler. This ruler is great to use with charm packs and cutting those charm squares into small pieces that you're going to turn into your quilt. So on the ruler, there are quarter inch, half inch, and three quarter inch lines, since those are the most common sizes that you cut. And also, the Creative Grids uh, great technology where it has non-slip on the back. And it also has a diagonal line, which is gonna help you trim up your half square triangles or trim them down. And I'm gonna show you that next. This is the best little ruler for small cuts. And goodness knows we have plenty of charm squares to use it with. So I'm gonna show you some different tips you can use with the ruler. So you can take a charm square and you can cut a four and a half inch square. So super easy, just cut two sides. And then you can just use these simple dotted lines to trim it down to four and a half inches. So you've got a perfect square and you just have a little ruler so you don't have to work with a bigger ruler. Now also from a charm square, you could also cut four two and a half inch squares. So since this is five inches square, first make sure it's five inches. And if it's a little bit bigger, you can just trim the sides if you want. And then you can cut four two and a half inch square. So you're just gonna use this big line right here that's the center of the ruler. You're gonna cut once, turn your mat, and you can cut again. So that's super easy to turn it into four two and a half inch squares. You can also cut a charm square into nine one and a half inch squares. So the first thing you want to do is cut a square that's four and a half inches. And then you're going to sub cut three strips across that are one and a half. So you can cut it the three inch. and the one and a half inch. And then you wanna do the same thing on the other side. Three inch. and then one and a half. So as you can see, you can cut nine one and a half inch squares really quick, four two and a half inch squares really quick, or a four and a half inch square. Now I'm gonna show you what you can do with half square triangles to square them up. So here I've got a half square triangle that's about four and a half. So we can either trim this up to four and a half or three and three quarters or three. I'm just gonna go ahead and do four and a half. So you place your diagonal line right on that half square triangle. And this is great if you want to just make your half square triangles slightly bigger when you're cutting and then you can trim it down. So from here, we just put that diagonal line right on there and we have a perfect four and a half inch square with a really small ruler so you're not having a big bulky ruler lying around. And you can do the same thing. I've got some smaller half square triangles. You can do the same thing. Here, I'm gonna trim it down to an inch and a half. You could also trim it to one and three quarters or two, but for fun, I'm just gonna do an inch and a half. And you can see the ruler's really easy to use because it's just the main the main lines, a quarter, half, three quarters. We hope you enjoy this brand new Creative Grids Perfect 5 ruler. You can pick it up at your favorite quilt shop.